one time my wife was standing in line and she wears the niqab. So when she's standing in line at the grocery store, somebody in the line said, go back to your country. You know, so, and she turned around and said, I was born in California. Where do you want me to go? <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, so we can stand up for ourselves. And actually those kinds of circumstances, they are there. And I think they are not just a challenge, but an opportunity for our women to learn to stand up for themselves and not take this garbage from anyone. And we have to stand by our women and allow them to function in any society in the world, you know, in a dignified fashion and not take this from anybody. You know, it's, it's high time that Muslims take pride in their faith and they take pride and confidence in who they are. And once we learn to do that, this is not being aggressive. This is just standing up for yourself. And human dignity is a part of peaceful existence. If you don't have dignity, you don't have peace within yourself, you know. So we have to do that. We have to learn to deal with that. And those of you that are from Western countries that have experienced this kind of harassment, I would urge you to raise your daughters to learn to stand up for themselves despite all of the challenges that are outside, inshallah, and still wear their religion with pride.